Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to do um, a little video on my abs and as you can see I'm not in the gym yet but so I did decide that I'm going to do maybe like a little bit of a home workout just for those who don't go to the gym or they don't really like going to the gym and like the gym can be quite expensive as well so I'm trying to find the time like your free time around family around kids it's so hard to do so I decided that I was going to do maybe a little bit of a like um an ab home workout if that suits people yeah so but I will be going to the gym later and um does anyone realize I'm in daytime <laughs> I just realized that I was like I've never filmed in daytime so um yeah, so I decided that I'm going to, because I'm off today, I'm just going to get stuck into a video. I'm going to do a home workout because I know a few people have asked me about doing home workouts. And that, like, especially for the people who don't get a chance to go to the gym. And, um, yeah, so it is good to kind of have, like, a few home workouts. So if there is any more ideas that you want me to do, maybe more home workouts, if you find this video is beneficial to you and um, yeah just drop it down in the box below comment and I will definitely do a video so I'm always open to ideas and stuff like that if there's anything that you want me to go through any kind of like more workouts foods that I eat stuff like that Um, yeah so don't mind like I've realised my face is like so droopy right now <laughs> I've had a really, really bad week this week. Um, I will be starting to get back into the gym properly. This week has just been such a kind of, I don't know, like I've just been eating so much. And like, I know it is, like I'm not gonna punish myself over it because it is good to have those kind of weeks where you're just like, do you know, you can eat. Like, so I just enjoy it this week, eating and just chilling out really. And yeah, so that's really it. And there's my cat crying again. <laughs> it's nearly feeding time for him, so he's he's probably not gonna leave me alone <laughs> until I feed him. Boy, he's not getting filled. Chase, come on over here. Like seriously, <laughs> he normally yeah. Uh, I try kind of hold off with his food because he wakes me up in the morning, and like he wakes up about four o'clock in the morning to get food. So he hasn't been fed since about four o'clock this morning. But I'm trying to kind of leave it a little bit just so. You know, because if I feed now and then, you know, Chase, come on over here, come on. God, yeah. So I'm gonna try to do this video. He probably be screaming at me in the background, but yeah. So I'm gonna get started. So with this workout that I'm gonna do, it is completely equipment free. So I'm going to go through literally. Like at home, I barely have any equipment anyway. I think I have like a dumbbell um, and a yoga mat. That's literally all I have that I that I use at home. But today I'm actually going to use completely nothing at all. Just for the guys that if you don't have anything like at home, like it is good to have like where you can see a workout being done with no, no equipment at all. So yeah, so I'm going to go straight into my abs and I'm going to show you a few ab workouts I do I actually do them in the gym as well so they are really really good for a home for at the gym you can like for the people that do go to the gym you can still 100% use these workouts they're not just purely for a home so yeah I'm gonna get straight into this this video if that's okay but yeah I have literally I'm gonna be using a yoga mat is the only piece of equipment I'm gonna use obviously like you don't have to have a yoga mat you can even have like a few pillows behind it you, you don't actually have to have anything at all i just have the yoga mat because i have wooden floors in my apartment so they can be quite harsh on the back that's that's all that's the only reason why i have that so yeah let's get into the workout so in this workout i done one minute of planks i find these amazing to strengthen the core so what it is is that you put your feet you can either put them together or apart it really depends on any individual i put them together and what it is is that you 
just kind of get low but not too low on the ground still have it a little bit off the ground and just pause literally for a minute i have my phone in front of me just to time me i find it's great just to just to time your minute so Had a dream, we were sipping a whiskey need Highest floor of the Bowery, and I was high enough There along the lines, that's what I've seen Eye to eye, we were seeing all night And I had enough, no I don't wanna know Where you been or where you going But I know I won't be home, and you'll be on your own So these are straight leg crunches These are great for strengthening the core so what you do is just either you can use a yoga mat, you can use a cushion, or you can just use the floor. Just lie straight down, keep your legs straight, and all you're using is your ab muscles. And then just make sure that you're crunching. I literally hold it and pause for a split second and then release. Another minute workout, these are great for tightening up the core, also they're great for the side area that it's always hard to burn off fat on that area, that these are really really good. I use them with a weight but these are brilliant for starting off with just to make sure that your form is on and to make sure that you're not injuring yourself so these are really really good. So I call these twisted planks. I find they're brilliant to work that side area, also strengthening the core. It's the exact form that you use in the first workout with the planks, but basically you're just moving the hips. This is another minute workout and this is knee to elbow plank. So what you do is you just kick your leg back but when you're bringing your knee into your elbow, make sure that you're crunching at all times, you're using the core strength and make sure that you can feel that tightness. Always make sure that you are breathing correctly and if you feel that the minute is a bit too long you can always shorten it no problem at all this is another one minute workout and this is known as a double crunch so it's the exact same format that is in my other workout at the start with the straight leg crunch so what you do is the exact same way but you're bringing your legs up to your chest and you're tightening your core and then slowly releasing down and back up again. I do this for one minute, but feel free if you want to do for less, that's not a problem at all. So this is called the bicycle workout. These are really, really good to work those abs, strengthen that core. Also, they help with the side weight. They get rid of any excess weight that you want to lose off there. So this is a completely new workout I've just added into this workout. So you raise your arm with your opposite leg while still crunching the abs. So this is great burn for the abs. I'm hoping I'm showing you guys right. This is uh, really, really good though. I did feel the burn off this. So I hope you enjoyed these little clips. So that is my at home ab workouts for the day. I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope you benefit from that video. My abs are really, really sore. So what I done was every round I done with the workouts, I done a minute of each circuit. 
so I know I didn't obviously add in the whole minute because I just I thought the video would just go on forever for you so I decided that I was after like about 10 or so or a little bit more I'd kind of stop it but I would continue with my circuit just to show what the basics really of what I was doing um, so yeah so I done one minute of each circuit and I done three rounds of that so obviously do what you're able to do don't obviously like strain yourself doing too much Um, i'd always recommend starting off kind of a little bit maybe each day and maybe or each week kind of gradually build it up a bit more Um, yeah because that's what i done when i first started the gym i'd always start off with kind of a lighter like lighter weight but also before i started doing the weights i would just get my format right get make sure he's still gone mad <laughs> sorry about that um he's actually been really good for the video i'm shocked so i'll be feeding him soon and <laughs> um, yeah so where was i oh yeah and um, the format so i was just always make sure that your your format's right because like that's where you can do the most injuries is when your body is in the correct way or if you're kind of straining your back or straining any area really so just be very very careful make sure that that's right before lifting any weights um yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed also i do recommend in within them circuits that i done drink plenty 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 of water i can't tell you enough that because i know there's some people like myself i actually never used to drink anything really now since going to the gym so for the last six seven months of going to the gym i have been um so going to the gym i started drinking water i've started drinking my bcaas Um, i use the women's best for anyone that wants to find some good bcaas i use the cola lime i personally love it i think that could be my new favorite now i haven't tried any of the other ones i have tried the iced tea peach which is really really nice but if i had to pick one it would be the cola lime um yeah so i started drinking water going to the gym like i used to never drink anything like i'd probably drink maybe a drink maybe with my dinner and that could have been just it now i've started to drink i'm trying to drink at least like two to three liters a day well even if i can only get a liter to two liters i'm happy enough with that Um, yeah because i used to like really suffer from back pains i used to suffer from chest pains Um, i used to get really bad headaches i used to um like i just overall felt shy about myself like um like i really felt so bad and i never really put it down to not drinking anything which was so weird like you'd like you you'd think i'd know but no i actually just i just thought it was just ah it's not that it's it may be because i'm because i am a hairdresser i'm standing on my feet all day i kind of just put it down to that but ever since i've started drinking water i have back pain not really anymore unless i'm kind of doing maybe standing on my feet if i'm really busy it could affect but other than that no chest pain no i haven't actually got that in a really really long time and headaches i always find i might still get the odd headache if i don't drink enough water and it's so weird because if i be in work and i you can feel like a headache coming on i run right into staff room grab a bit of water and i'm actually grand like it's like i never really put down to anything like that due to water which you think it, you would like you're dehydrated like your body needs water like like as much as it's so weird that 80 percent of your body is water but you still need that water intake there like so i never really put down kind of things like that to me so yeah so i will highly recommend drinking water during these circuits like so every circuit you do or if you feel like after every workout you do just have a drink beside you and just sip away on it um so don't just wait till like obviously if you thirsty before the circuit ends like please like you know work away so just have it right beside you so you're there always make sure after every circuit you take maybe if about 40 seconds to a minute bro like a water break not like a break as such but like a water break where you're still getting ready to do your next circuit but 
make sure that you have your water beside you you can have your bcaas i find them brilliant now i don't like i don't drink them if i'm not going to the gym like obviously you can because there's like you know they're just kind of like a more of a boost of energy as such but without all the sugar and like the red bull and coke and all that it's nothing like that at all it's literally diluted into like your water it's like a little powder if you haven't seen it um i think it's in my it could have been before christmas i done an unboxing of my wins women's best and i showed what it kind of looked like so yeah i'd use that purely just for the gym if i wasn't going to the gym i wouldn't actually use it i just stick to my water and um yeah so i hope this workout was beneficial to use i know the lighting in this sitting room is so 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 bad like now it's fine but when i'm over there like it's just because i have a window over there and it's just everything shines through so it's actually really really bad and um, yeah so i'm gonna leave the video here i'm not gonna blabber on too much i'm gonna let you enjoy the rest of your day i'm gonna feed chase before he eats me so <laughs> i'm gonna let you go you can probably hear him screaming he's probably like feed me now yes chase we're gonna feed you now jesus christ it doesn't give you a minute yeah so i'm gonna go feed him and i shall be back with another video and please like subscribe tap the little bell beside you so you'll never miss another video um if there's any ideas that you want me to do if there's any videos you think you'd like me to like you to see me do um please leave it below i will definitely definitely do a video on it and yeah so i'm gonna wrap this up now and i hope you enjoy the rest of your day and your night and i will see you in the next video bye <laughs>